north of the Seraphan tomb, your brother Rahab has secluded himself and his progeny in the ruins of a half-drowned abbey. Welcome back to Kelvin's Coin TV, everybody. My name is Ross, and this is Legacy of Cain, Soul Weaver. We uncovered the Seraphan tomb, found out that we used to be Seraphan before we were vampire. Uh, and so we're all our brothers. We got a few glyphs, some other power-ups. We are finally done completely with uh, the, the uh, Silence Cathedral. Now we're going to the Drowned Abbey to kill Rahab. Here we go. Alright, so now we're back up here. In the Spectral Realm. Oh, I see. I totally missed that. How silly of me. Boom. Here we go, son. Fight some fish monsters. Cool. All right, fish monsters. What you got for me? Once a sanctuary against the vampire menace, this alley has been drowned by the deluge spilling from this wounded land. Your brother Rahab and his brood, devastated even by the feeble rays of Nazgoth's sun, overcame their vulnerability to water and retreated from the surface. Now they haunt these ruins and glide in the darkness of its stagnant depths. <laughs> Alrighty. Should see some swimming around. Little minnows. Funny, that's where Rahab is. He's in that room, actually, right in front of us. I find it be funny. Uh-oh. Make it. Make it! Alright, so we got a gate we can phase through down there. I'm going to stay in the material realm as long as I can. Those are not climbable walls. We'll leave that there. Look at him dancing around. I think you hang around spikes. Oh, that didn't work. Jesus. Throw him on the spikes. Ah. You can just force projectile that guy onto the spikes right away. That would have been cool. What about playing the Mario RPG games? Oh, that would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool for sure. Big Magic 124, are you going to stream any of these when you play them? Because I'll watch. Movable block underwater. That's interesting. All right, who else wants them? What's all this then?
Alright, let's try that again, shall we? Angles randomly. I wonder if I can do this in the spectral. What the hell is that? Into water. Okay. I said I wanted to see where they went, so here we go. Adapted well to your environment for one so maladjusted. Do not mock me, Raziel. You of all of us should respect the power bestowed by a limitation overcome. Kane said you would come. You speak with the murderer? You would do well to mind your blasphemous tongue. What more did he tell you? That you would destroy me. I will indeed. But tell me. Before I tear your soul from its moorings, do you know what we were before Cain spawned us? Human. Seraphan Rahab, the antithesis of all we ever believed. Does it matter? We were lost. He saved us. Saved us? From what? From ourselves.
son of a bitch. Raziel, come on. Overcome your former vulnerability to water's touch. Immersion in water will no longer dissolve your physical body, enabling you to swim to areas heretofore beyond your reach. Fantastic. Hey, let's do that. Let's do that right now. Crouch jump. Thanks. Yeah, it's a baseball swim. Oh, I hate that. I hate the inverted axis. Okay, where's the door? Where's the door? Where's the door? Alright, let's do this. Did it. Wintry snow time. So pretty, so fun. Portal. Actually, it just teleported really quick. If there's anything else around. There's not. Oh, this city once teemed with the life of my kind. Could it be that other clans had suffered the same fate as mine? In his madness, could Cain spare none of his brood? It was not Cain, but Dumas' own arrogance that brought the downfall of his clan. These are human weapons, Raziel. Believing themselves invincible, Duma and his offspring fail to see an attack coming from the least likely assailants. Complacent in their arrogance, they were taken by surprise, allowing the human vampire hunters to decimate their ranks with little resistance. The few that escaped have been reduced to scavengers.
Huh. Oh, there's a raid. Look out! It's coming after us. Doesn't look like it. This way. We are in fact headed this way. Vaguely remember this. We need to phase them. Did we knock this over somehow? Yes, we do. That's it. I remember. I think we knocked that obelisk over somehow and it smashes one of the gates. come back here when we have the constrict ability constrict this thing and it'll turn it I'll open all these doors oh I can face the door but I tried to earlier and I couldn't camera. Where are we going now? Oh, I see what I have to do. So silly. Alright, I'm gonna shoot the block from the outside and push it against that wall, maybe? Shift. 
Yep. Hey. Alright. Now we are here, which means jump across there. Maybe. Yes. Maybe this is how. Those guys are back alive. Pray for them. I think this puzzle is get up there and to do so you need to get one block from this side over to the other oh you know what I can't jump that high this puzzle already. I need two blocks on the other side. Perfect. Oh, my camera died. One moment. I figured it out. I got it. I don't have the biggest brain. But it's good enough for blocks. There we go. So, crouch, flip, boom. And then, crouch. Crouch, flip, boom. And jump. And push. We got a stack of three. We got our other block in there. We're rocking and rolling. We're blocking and bowling. Well, that's the solution. You have to get two blocks from the first well to the middle divider. And then make a stack of three from the middle divider. Push the second block you got from the first well in so that you can stand on that to jump up to the stack of three. Like this. And then you get to the tippity top. Boom, baby. Shit. Damn it. <laughs> oh, uh, I know what this is. Yeah, this is how we kill Duma, actually. Pretty sure. We have to lure him back here. And pull this lever. Yeah, and we blast him with that. Melt of the doors as well. Sick. Uh, what's over here? This way. Oh, hello. Anything else over here? Oh, 
right? These don't look right. Oh, crap. They got higher. Okay, so I gotta jump over to them and then... Unless it'll let me get there from here. Uh, yes. didn't change anything. the lever. There's a conduit. Maybe that was the right way to do it. I face this way. Huzzah! And now we jump on back. And we squeeze the handle. Baby. Awesome song. Let's go. I don't know. First time I've been here in the material realm. Aha. Follow the light. Follow. A light. Probably cannot make that. Yep. Maybe? Yep. Oh, there's a conduit right in there. Almost blew that.
My brother, Dumas, a powerful warrior in life. He would have burned with shame to have me find him here like a stuck pig. Gross. Thank you, brother. Your thanks are premature, Dumas. I have not forgotten whose hands bore me into the abyss. The centuries in limbo have honed my strength. Not even Cain is my equal. Even the strongest vampire is vulnerable. We shall test your thesis, Raziel. My bloodthirst has been superseded by an even darker hunger. I will consume your soul before this day is done. Okay. Yeah, Dumas, the last brother we, we get to face. There were two others, Terrell and Malik. Well, Malik was a Seraphine. I don't know if Malik was ever a... Uh, Never a vampire. Wait a minute. Oh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I I don't want to deal with this right now. also in the spectral realm. It's kind of a problem, actually. Get me now, you horse's ass. Stupid or something? Come on. There he is. He is stupid. He's fucking running in circles.
Uh oh. The furnace is definitely not lit. Why isn't the furnace lighting? I don't like that. There we go. Die! Consuming Duma's soul empowers you to wind a constricting band of spectral energy around your enemies. This energy manifests itself in both the spectral and material realms. And in the physical world, it can be employed to manipulate otherwise immovable objects. Fantastic. GG. Alright. Yep. Oh, this is so much easier to do on PlayStation. Come on. Come on. Puzzle solved. Increases our glyph energy. Or, re or replaces it, rather. Refills it. Recharges it. And it comes One of these, I think, is a way out. I don't want to take quite yet. We have the glyphs, might as well use them, right? Your soul? Yes, but what the hell is the point of this one? Nothing? Nothing was the point of this room? Is that what you're telling me? There's nothing over here? Alright, well, they can't all be winners, I guess. Thank you all for watching Kelvin's Coin. My name is Ross. This has been Legacy of Cain, Soul Reaver. See you in the next episode, and we're going to finally get to the Human Citadel, and we'll do the Water Glyph, 
We'll do the fire glyph, the sunlight glyph. We'll get the fire reaver. I'm going to do all that stuff in the next couple of episodes. Thank you all for watching. See you then. Bye.